Hello everyone, it's Julia and this is the vlog from the thick of the Olympiad season. Uh, in today's video I will tell you about the last week in my life which was so packed with both uh, potatoes and uh, um, taking part in the finals of the Olympiads and having fun as well. And so there we begin. I just want to mention that on Sunday the 11th of February, I was interviewed by uh, the Olympiad school where I'm preparing for the Olympiads. Well, just please uh, keep this fact in mind because it will be important later. And now we move on to Monday. But before we begin, I, want, I also want to thank two people. They are Ivan and Karina, and my special thanks to them are for, first of all, agreeing to be featured in this video, and second, for helping me to actually film it. Now, as I'm walking, I'd like to give a small update on how the, thing, the things have been going. So it's uh, now Monday, the 12th of February, and I'm going uh, in search of some robbing paper, because I needed to rob the presents for the upcoming holidays. You want to get some wildfish holidays and talk. As for the weather, the weather is just brilliant. Uh, it is honestly nippy. But it's not like the unpleasant um, freezing thing, no. It's like the thing. It's invigorating, it's chilly. Everyone has uh, rosy cheeks and the air is like made of crystals. On Tuesday I studied yet again, uh, there were a plenty of things uh, to do and uh, there were some funny moments too. For example, right at the beginning of the evening class in the conference uh, there only were me, my friends and the teacher. On uh, Wednesday I took part in one of the Olympiads. So well. It's February the 14th and I'm having an Olympiad today and this is one of the Olympiads that I've been preparing for most. I'm honestly kind of keyed up. You see that I've already got changed for it because you have to wear something smart uh, whilst um, doing the test, which is by the way online, which is why I'm still at home. Well, we'll see how it's all pans out. But I think I've already mentioned that it's Wednesday now. Uh, yesterday was Tuesday and I spent the whole day preparing for the Olympiads and now it is the evil hour. Um, it's half past 10, the Olympiad starts at 11 and it lasts for three hours. Hopefully I will be able to produce some something decent. I don't think that I will be making any um, predictions about the results uh, either now or right after the Olympiad. First of all, just let me put it uh, so uh, let me put it in the way that I'm hoping that it will be something nice. Yesterday I also started reading a new book. Yep, it is a very sensible idea to pick up the fourth book when you can't uh, finish uh, three others. Um, well, I'm really desperate uh, uh, about not having time to read enough uh, and I hope that I will be able to change it after uh, this horrible week full of Olympiads, packed with Olympiads and then finish everything that I started, but we'll see. Oh, uh, my favorite joke is that 
Uh, I have made so many jokes about me loving English uh, that uh, thanks to today's Olympiad I spent Valentine's Day with English. So, uh, see you later and good luck to me! After the Olympiad, uh, about the results of which I don't want to make any predictions uh, yet, I had some fun. I watched uh, a film and uh, just decompressed from all the stress, because this Olympiad was one of the most important. And I also got those beautiful flowers, for it was the 14th of February. Thirdly, was, was another day cramped completely with uh, studying, uh, studying, studying, and even more studying. There was nothing fun about it, but uh, Friday truly was uh, the day when real fun began. On, on that day, uh, we had an Olympiad in Russian. What a way to win a war. After that, I went to a restaurant to have pizza, and also in the evening I went to the theater to see Giselle. How was it doing this? Perfect. I hate it. <laughs> <laughs> so like, yeah. uh, there were three tasks. If you fail one, uh, you won't get the diploma. I think they are pretty generous uh, with the points and they tend to give at least something for something. not so bad idea. Yeah, I didn't know that. Uh, well, according to my information, it's like that. Mm. Then, you know, it was sort of a limpid when you wanna get out of there and n never, never come back. <laughs> well, yeah, that, that's, that's true, that's 100% yeah. that's, that's true. Um, all of them were um, not so, so easy, let's put it so. Well, they were extremely hard, you know, like... Uh... Yeah, I mean, uh, there were parts uh, that were pretty easy to guess, like the last uh, part of the last task, well, it, it took me around cake. 15 minutes to guess it, so it was not really easy. But well, 15 minutes out of 3 hours is nothing. Yeah, but for the first time it took 30 seconds. This is, I, I kept, like, I had, uh, it took me, I think, an hour to solve it, and I'm still yeah. not sure if it was right. Um, but I, I say that we will agree that the second task was uh, like uh, uh, a <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Everything was insane. Let's put it that way. <laughs> okay, let's say like that. of this channel. Yes. So, how did you like this Giselle performance? That was great. Um, I haven't seen it before. And, well, yeah, particularly I loved it. Oh, so what did you it like the most? Uh, it was uh, the dance of um, the dead <laughs> girls. On the dead white. girls? Yeah. But I, I just, I'm not sure about their proper name in English. Therefore, <laughs> to call them dead girls, I think yeah. I will... Google it. Yeah, I will Google for it and I will put it down 
uh, on the video, but for now I don't know what's All going right. properly. What, what do you think about the main uh, dancers? Great. Especially Great. the... Uh, I'm, I w I'm really sorry for uh, the main character because uh, the ballerina uh, slipped on the yeah. floor. I well, guess because uh, everybody so was yes dancing around and it just got polished, way too polished. And it's just uh, she was perfect and uh, so so gracious and everything, but she slipped and uh, well for me it doesn't mean anything, but for uh, for her for her it must uh, mean a lot. I guess not only for uh, her but for the critics because yeah. they notice every single mistake of theirs. Yeah. And I still didn't get who is the second. Who was the second battery? You know? She was also yeah, quite... Yeah, uh, the second was that girl. I don't know either. Okay, we gotta go now. Bye. <laughs> Let's begin with the fact that it's snowing. Yeah! It's about to snow. Just uh, put the camera up. Well, yeah. Turn it. Uh, it can't be turned now, but well. It is snowing. Yeah. It's snowing. The roads are gonna be as slippery tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but anyway, well, as if it was December and not uh, the middle mid-February. And now, Karina, uh, I think that it was the first ballet you've seen in your life. Yeah. What are your impressions? Uh, well, um, the main dancer in this... What is that? Cats? <laughs> size? What is that? Wow! <laughs> <laughs> it was kind of mind-blowing. But what about the plot? I don't know. <laughs> what about the plot? Well, it was a little bit hard to, disti to like, yeah, distinguish who is who and what is what. Uh, because well, it happens with ballet. Yeah, without reading this little brochure that uh, you bought, I wouldn't have understood it. Well, that's why I bought it in the first place. Yeah, and on top of that, um, uh, I was attending classic dance for I don't know four to six years, four, four to five years of my life, and I can see how terrible these moves are in the terms of stamina and effort put into them, and see how easily they do that. Okay, put upon easily. Just yeah, like I think that, that, that's the case because uh, I see that it must take a lot of str muscle strength, a lot of uh, stamina, uh, a lot of effort, but it and all ability. seems to be so effortless. Yeah, and inability to, um, you know, bear with pain because it's goddamn painful in these things. I don't know how to call them in English as well. <laughs> you will go it later. Yeah, <laughs> this will be on the screen too. And put it in the video. So, yeah, it was awesome. And you know how I also realized that they are super tired? How? Uh, when the man was falling, he was breathing so rapidly. If you paid attention, his chest was heaving like hell. So, yeah. <laughs> uh, I think um, your, your eyes see better than mine. <laughs> it's just the one who I was looking at, because his costume, the next one, like, I mean, the costume in the second act. Uh, yeah, yeah, perfect. the uh, purple one. Yeah, no, the, yeah, the costumes of everybody. I mean, of the uh, ballet. Uh, yeah, uh, the, co dancers. the costumes in the first uh, act were really nice, but in the second uh, act, uh, yeah. they're just uh, out of this world. Mind blowing. Yeah, exactly. And uh, the dogs, they brought the dogs to this. Event. By the way, it's one of my favorite breeds of them. Uh, I don't know how to call them in English as well. <laughs> you gotta Google them for And I'm just bad at, uh, naming, at naming dogs. <laughs> yeah, it was awesome. But I could could see how uh, scared these dogs were. They were like, oh my god, what is going on? So many people, so much music. Exactly like me, though. <laughs> <laughs> well, and here I think uh, we're ending this part of, of the vlog because my hands, uh, which is kind of holding the camera, is frozen. Saturday was a day of uh, one more Olympics. This time it was uh, in English, and uh, all the people from this vlog um, met exactly there. What about the impressions? Uh, impressions? Uh, no impressions. I still want to drown in Milan. I mean, the country studies were really bad. They were awesome. <laughs> yeah, perfect. Like best country studies I've ever seen I mean, in, in I terms like of the um, thing. I googled it, you know? I googled it and it's a... Uh, Thank god I never, uh, I didn't choose it. Which? Gleeman. Gleeman. Gleeman? Oh. Yeah. I chose... Ooh. You didn't yeah. choose him? I, why? So, there was one. The, the, this, this, guy's, this guy was in the answer, yeah? No, no he wasn't. No. I've also chosen him as... Um, the king's 
I, I didn't choose him. It's oh. it's, it's, <laughs> yeah, I'm out of it now. Yeah, of course. Well, um, the period itself was nice. I mean, we all know about Roman Contest, right? Well, yeah, it's better than last year's Roman Empire. No, well, for us, Roman Empire is perfect. Yeah, Roman Empire was better. Uh, I oh, used to be Roman Empire buff wow, like in year six. So I'm really good at it. But Norman Conquest. Well, it could have been worse. Yeah, for sure. Actually, yeah. But it could be the first world war. Yeah, yeah. country studies would be nice. No, it would be really easy. Reading was really. Yeah. Reading was easy, guys. Reading. Oh, well, yeah, reading was, reading yeah. was nice. The only one thing that I'm sure about, by the way, here. Maybe, maybe listening, it was also quite nice. I mean, the questions were obvious. Whether they are true or false. Well, at least uh, we got the same number of not tainted. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, so yes. that was nice. That was at least something. Oh, yeah. Pure emotions. I hate it. Hate, hate. You hate what? The no, Olympiad. Well, it was nice. I mean, I was no. treasuring it for three months, and it was nice to finally come here and do that. And honestly, I feel how this burden is lifted from my shoulders. So. What was the general impression? Oh, just uh, summarize it in, in one phrase. I'll never write this Olympiad ever more. <laughs> and you? Summarize it. I feel like a glee man. And uh, my summary is that the war is not over, but it's a truth. After, um, after the Olympiad, uh, Karina and I went uh, for a walk in the city center and we also had a dinner out uh, in a restaurant um, because uh, we desperately wanted to have some tartar. Ich, ich habe eine Frage für dich allein, mein Bruder. Wie ein Sengle werfe ich diese Frage in deine Seele, dass ich wisse, wie tief sie sei. Du bist jung und wünschst dir Kind, dir kind und äh, Aber ich frage dich, bist du ein Mensch, der ein Kind sich wünschen darf? Bist du der Siegreiche, der selbst, der selbst Bezwinger, der Gebieter der Sinne, der Herr well, right. deiner so, Tugenden? What have you got out of this paragraph? Um, he talks something about like, uh, are you the person who really can uh, wish for something? Like, I see the words that are familiar, but I can't quite make out what <laughs> the sense is. Well, maybe well, you that's got what it right. What, that's what uh, you can learn about my level of German. And also, Mom, you, you, you read perfectly, I mean. Well, yeah, at least I can read. After three, no, almost four years of uh, studying German at school, I think I could have done better, but at least I'm able to read. I mean, who needs this German anyway? <laughs> Well, yeah, English is better. You of see? course. Look at this. English, English, English. Oops, German, English. So, it's my first time trying tartar. And tartar, yes. So, I don't know how it's gonna go, but hopefully I'll love it. All right, let's dig in. Pick it is just. Look at this, it's layered. Oh, cheers. Cheers. Smells truly divine, and hopefully it will taste the same. Yeah, what about yours? I have some chicken. Chicken is a safe bet. So well, uh, we were so busy hanging out, attending theaters, museums, center of the city, dressing out, dressing out, and doing the course all together, right? Yeah. And so we missed our, our own Olympia. Interview. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it's we were waiting for it for a week. It's okay. Yeah, we've been yeah, we'll waiting for it for it. Like we were asking for each other every day. Yeah, and, and then we met in real life. And before that, they even yeah, met. Yeah, I came out yesterday. And it's so, no, we are learning about it. From another two person, by the way. We didn't even look it up. Yeah, we were just so, like, cold. It's been more than a day since it came out. And it's only now that we're learning about it. We are cringe, but in a good sense, you know. Yeah. I mean, we had we had such a fun life, such a good time that we yeah. forgot. Yeah, yeah. We forgot about it. So, awesome. 
This girl just was born at the Peninsula Olympiad. I got two results uh, today and I am... I mean, the moment, God damn it, I'm having just a moment. I, I see. Hopefully, I, hopefully, I just achieved the third one today, right? Sweet. Oh my god. Yeah, that's great. It's just your influence. It's your positive influence, I can swear. My Sunday started uh, with lots of maths homework for my Monday maths class and uh, after that in the afternoon I met with uh, Karina for whom it was the last day in my city and um, we went to a museum which was honestly great. So sweetie you had another interest? You yep. Well it was a walk in the park. Surprisingly some Olympiads are. Yeah, now yeah, I understand how though. you feel. Now but I understand how you no, feel. No, I don't feel like this. Is... Come on. Oh, yes, yes, <laughs> yes. Maybe it's your influence. Yeah. My, it might be. I hope that I don't uh, uh, lose my neck for a little bit. You will not. I have luck. You have uh, determination and experience, so it's yeah. gonna be. Oh, yeah. by the way, the weather is nice. It is uh, very it is sunny awesome. and uh, only mildly cold. Just the wind, just the wind. I was almost blown up today. When yeah, I was but uh, in the city center, it, it's lovely. But unfortunately, where I live, um, I fall, I fall down because of the <laughs> ice on the road. <laughs> well, yesterday I fell down and hit my head on the metal uh, fence. So yes, yes. It was yesterday. <laughs> it was epic. So yeah, that's it. We are going to the Hermitage. Yeah, uh, we're going to see Gainsborough's uh, Woman in Blue. There will be a review. The value of my classical education. Something about uh, Theophilus, uh, who was the son of uh, I don't know who exactly he was. Something about his mother too. Well, anyways, I can read it out loud. Uh, that's what I studied. What, that's what I've been studying Greek for for already like four years. <laughs> uh, we came to see England. Hope we're gonna prepare for the country studies in here. Yeah, well, <laughs> and there she is. This but is Woman in Blue by Gainsborough. to the end of this video which i hope you have enjoyed and if you want to see me again talking about life or books which i also do please subscribe to my channel julia caesar and bye